Hey, this is Ted, AKA Walk Wildside, with another episode of Vegan MacGyver. I've already eaten dinner and had some dessert, so I'm gonna be making for you no cooking nut butter oats. At the market today, um, I was able to pick up a banana, some uh, Justin's Maple Almond Butter, one of my favorites, some hemp milk, and then they had bulk bins, so I got some oatmeal and also some chia seeds. So about maybe two tablespoons of chia seeds and about half a cup of oats. And again, that's one of the reasons that I love the bulk bins because you can just get small amounts of things. So the way you go ahead and make overnight oats uh, is go ahead and mash up the banana inside of a plastic bag. Make sure the plastic bag's relatively new so that it doesn't spring a leak. You're gonna mix in the, the almond milk or nut milk, whatever you've got. I have hemp milk this time. And then to that, you're gonna add in the chia seeds and the nut butter. And you just mix that all up and then you'll finally add in the oats. So the final thing you do uh, before waiting is put it in the fridge. And if you don't have a fridge, that's okay. I've actually put this on ice in an ice bucket and it keeps okay, I mean, it's fine. There's nothing in there that's gonna really spoil within a few hours. There's nothing left to do except turn off the lights and go to sleep. All right, so I've just woken up and taken out the oatmeal from the refrigerator. I haven't even changed out of my pajamas and here it is. It's looking great. I mean, maybe it doesn't look like much here, but as soon as I start putting it into the cup to eat, it'll look beautiful. I usually layer it with fruit. You know, a little bit of fruit on the bottom of the cup, then some oatmeal, then more fruit, because that way I don't have to mix it all up and it's just it looks like a nice little parfait. Here it is. No cooking nut butter overnight oats. Mm, great way to start a morning.